Yo, what's up, nerds? Welcome back to Tea Time with your favorite software engineer. If you guys haven't already, check out my channel, subscribe, smash that like button because I know you guys are gonna like this video. You're gonna learn something. So, um, today I'm going over reorder list, medium problem, uh, leak code. I know there's other YouTubers who have already done videos on this, but I'm going to show you guys a different solution that maybe you haven't thought of. It's not as efficient, but it's easier. It's a lot less code. I think it's easier to understand. So let's jump right into the description. Given a singly linked list, L0 through LN reordered so to L0, LN, L1, LN minus one. So basically we're doing first, last, and then the next one, and then the one before the last. So we have one, four, two, three. So pretty simple. That's the problem I'm gonna go over on this whiteboard. So. Uh, let me move this out of the way a little. So um, what we're gonna wanna do is we're going to want to somehow reach the last and the second to last. We're gonna wanna have pointers there so that we can move them while we maintain our pointers at the beginning. So if we put say second last here and last, and then we just move them along, eventually last will end up here and second last will end up here. And then we can just adjust the pointers. So we know that we're just going to have one at first and then we're going to have last. We have last. So we just put um, head dot next equals last. Um, I'm going to label that differently. Head dot next equals last. Um, but the first we want to set a um, like a temporary pointer to the head, uh, to head dot next. So we're going to do temp equals head dot next. Um, and we need to do this before we change head dot next. So technically we're doing head dot next, um, equals temp, but I was just showing you guys it in the diagram up here. Um, so head dot next or temp is temp is right here. So we have temp. So then we can just do, uh last dot next and this is getting sloppy sorry guys last dot next equals temp and then um so we still have three here but we're going to want to do second dot second last dot next that next equals temp so i believe that so we have head dot next equals last you know what, let's just go right to the white uh coding um i started to get messy but i hope you guys understand the main concept so our, our base cases is if head or equals null or head dot next equals null or head dot next dot next equals null then we're just going to return, let me zoom out a little, um, because we don't need to change anything. So let's go ahead and create our pointers. So we have last equals head dot next, and we have second last equals head. And so then we're just going to loop through while last until we get to the end. So while last dot next does not equal null. We're just going to iterate both of those. So last equals last dot next and second last equals second last dot next. Okay. So now let's go ahead and do what I was writing before. So snow temp equals head dot next head dot next equals. Um, so head dot next equals last so we're doing head this is head dot next and we're going to set it equal to last which is what we want and then we need to do head dot next equals temp or no head dot next temp equals head dot next so i did that oh i did that so and then head dot next equals not temp, it's last. This is last. That's why I was confused. Okay. 
So then second, um, it's not second last dot next, it's head dot next. So I was really, no, last dot next. Last dot next equals temp. Since this is the last, so we're doing last dot next equals temp. I had it on the freaking diagram too. Last dot next equals temp. And then we just want to set um, second last dot next. So second last dot next. We want to point it, there's nothing after it anymore because we moved last to the after head. So we're going to set it equal to null. And second last dot next equals null. And then so temp is now our new head because we already we already did one and four. Um, so now we just need to do these three. Imagine if the list continued, um, the new head is right here at temp. So we just, this is basically a recursive solution. So reorder list temp. Sweet. And it works. Oh. So it's really slow, um, runtime wise, I'm actually not sure. We're just looping through the list once. So technically it's still O of N. I believe the solution they provided is also O of N. Um, I'm not sure why it's so much slower. Um, and we didn't use any more data structures and that other than, you know, list nodes. We don't, those are just, those are not data structures, those are just nodes, list nodes. We need those anyways, it's... Yeah. Yeah.